The main, the main complaint is blood in the urine, either at the stream, at the end of the stream or at the beginning. Yeah. Then uh, for how many days? About uh, four, five days. Is it the first time? First time, yes. Well, what other complaints? Itchiness? Because there uh, seems to be some bandage. Yes, yes, itchiness, so I bandage her up, but uh, the itchiness just happens suddenly. Maybe today? Uh, yes, today. Which part is itchy? You remove the bandage, you can see it. Okay, I'll remove it now. How you know the dog is itchy? Yeah? Because she, she scratched so it's itchy. Which part she scratches? The underneath. The no part. I will pull it up. Okay, let's see. Come turn, turn the knob off. Below is it mental? Right? Okay. We hold there. Okay, turn. Okay, that might extend also. Okay. Which part is itchy now? Yes. Yeah, hang on. Yeah. Uh, okay, at first uh, it was very red, but I applied tea tree, uh, tea tree mm. ointment. It's because tea tree ointment seems to work very well on her. So this part is it? Yeah. Unpeed now? Last time when she had this itchiness on top, tea tree also worked on her. Okay, so unpeed now, right? Mm. And then this one, uh, mm. here, here, here. Yeah. No, the itchiness starts from where to where? Is it just the oh, lower part? Only the unpeed only. Only the, the okay, left unpeed, yeah. Uh? Yeah, left unpeed. Today, Nina? Yeah. For now, it, it looks like it has subsided so much. Okay, so... Okay, come from down already. Now, that one is uh, sometimes it's due to some contact. With oh, some or could it because my daughter just bought a, some kind of attire for her to wear for Chinese New Year? Could be some year, contact with yeah. your whole person. Now, check the ears. Part of it could be due to ears. So, wait, you hold the you hold the mouth or something? Yeah, but I so I check the ears. Normally, if I put this cotton bud in, and if there's no 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 reaction on the back leg, that means it's not so bad. But the dog has has reaction on okay, this side, but not so bad. Reaction means that there's what? Pain. Uh, there's some pain. Uh, let me put this side. Now, normally, you see the leg should be. Uh, overall, it's okay. Uh, there's a bit of pain, but it's very clean. Uh. Yeah. So I would say the ears are normal. Uh. Ears clean uh, times two. Uh. So now the main problem is, is the yeah. blood in the urine because that is more important. See. Now blood in the urine because this dog is not sterilized, so is she on heat or not? When was the last heat? Uh? Uh, last don't, heat period? We don't, I don't know. Huh? Sometimes you see the swelling. Uh. And this part, is it normally swollen? Or is it this size? Do you know? Because I mean, if she's having menstruation, you'll swell a bit, right? Yeah, so is this normal? This or? I think it's normal. To me, it looks a bit swollen. Maybe she's having a uh, menstruation. Do you know when the last hit? Uh, the last bleeding? Uh, which month was it? Or how many months ago? We. She, because she, she's very clean, and she, she doesn't stay there. And Okay, uh, this one shows that the dog has inner sac infection. Huh? That's why she keeps on licking this, this blue, blue part. Okay. Okay. Do you press the glands or did anybody press the glands? You press the gland. No, oh, last time. Maybe. You press it? Oh my god, right? You press the gland. Huh? It's very smelly, I remember. Last time? Uh? Yeah. Now no more, right? Yeah. Don't have notice, it's not so swollen. Yeah. It's the last time you press the gland. Mm. Now it's okay, it seems, seems to be okay because otherwise oil will come out. Huh? Okay, so now. This blood in the urine, it only happens in the urine only, right? I mean, if there's no urination, will no, there be blood? No, no, no. So, most likely, it's not due to the heat period, no? because heat period, the blood will come whether there's urine or not. No? So now, I look at the history. Now, the history in August 2013, yeah? the history of the urine test. Now, the urine test shows that uh, there's a little bit of blood at that time, yeah? but there's infection. And then uh, the pH is 9.0. So this shows that the urine is alkaline and the involvement in the crystal is triple phosphate. Triple phosphate is, uh, is those uh, crystals in the bladder. So there's presence of these uh, yeah. crystals? Yeah, crystals. Yeah. So, so it's most likely this dog has uh, bladder stones or sometimes bladder and kidney stones. So I will check the the bladder at my palpation. So normally I will just use my use my uh, fingers and uh, feel for any stones. Uh, and you'll see the reaction of the dog if there's pain or uh, 
It doesn't seem to have any pain. Pain, pain? No. No. So it's good news. The bladder is not full or, or swollen. But I do feel the bladder is quite a thick, thick wall. Which means it's a uh, That it has been inflamed for some time. Now whether there are stones or not, some, sometimes the stone is so small. So uh, it's not easy to feel, to, to feel, feel it. This but there seems to be small stones. This kind of stone is a common in Schnauzer. Yeah, Schnauzer's uh, are famous for why, why is the, so the breed, uh, this breed. Uh, but why is it so long? Normally due to dry food. Uh, so I can feel the bladder is quite thick. It's about the size of a, of a fish ball. The yeast and the bladder is thick. Uh, whether there are small stones inside or that will depend on the x-rays. Huh? So, so in August, I did advise uh, to, to take the diet SD to dissolve the, the triple phosphate crystals. Huh? So take for one month to three months. And after that, uh, when it's dissolved, it, you take a urine test again. And if it's shown in the negative crystals, then uh, from then on, the dog will need to take canned food. Or, or wet food. food, no more dry food. Why? Yeah. Because the dry food, they, uh, they tends to form uh, uh, crystals and stones. Yeah. Any other uh, solid food that will not cause this? Maybe other brands? Yeah, there are some brands uh, which alkaline the, which acidify the urine because the urine nine point zero is very alkaline, alkaline, and then the bacteria. The, the bacteria is present also. You see in August uh, three plus, so the bacteria and the alkaline urine. Uh, causes uh, this, uh, we call it the strobite stones to form, is it, or crystals, and uh, they irritate the bladder wall. So that's why you see some blood, because there are not so many. So that's why you only see now and then. And if the dog drinks a lot of water, there, there isn't any. You see. But in this case, there is no need to do operation. Uh, of course, the X-ray is, is best. It's recommended to do this, but sometimes it will show nothing because the crystals are. Not many are uh, small. So, uh, since a urine test shows triple phosphate, occasional it means not many. Uh, so, uh, and the signs and symptoms of blood in the urine recently. So, there are uh, there are some uh, uh, infection of the urinary tract. So, the the best is antibiotics plus the the feeding of the SD diet to dissolve the crystals. Normally it takes one to three months, you know, so it doesn't mean that two weeks it will dissolve. Then uh, the best is to check for, you do a urine test every, let's say, uh, monthly. Then, uh, so let's say there are three tests negative, which means it's clear. It's clear. Uh, clear. And then, uh, drinking a lot of water doesn't help. Uh, it so does, it does help to flush out the, the crystal. Because the good thing about her is that she can be encouraged to drink water, she will drink. How about dry food? Is she still eating? What, what dry food is she eating? Uh, <laughs> still eating dry food, right? Uh, huh? Appetite good, right? A good appetite, yes. Urine? Urine also good. No, the, the drinking good, right? Good. Drinks okay. a lot or Very drink normally? Good. Yeah, drinks a lot? She drinks a lot and as and when we want her to drink, we just ask her to drink, she can finish a whole container of water. Mm. Urine a lot? Urine a lot also. Because she drinks a lot of water. Uh, stools normal. Normal. The temperature is normal, so overall the dog is active, right? Yeah, it's so active. Yeah, so a bit slim, okay. Yeah. So the other thing well, about... The slim is because of the you, uh, the blood, then I was overseas. So I told the maid not to give too much dog food. I'm sorry, food first, give a, a lot of water first, until I come back. Mm -hmm. So uh, the, the management of this case is uh, using the diet to dissolve the crystals. Of course, antibiotics and then check the urine every month. This one is you think it's allergy, is it the itchiness? Yeah, yeah, slight allergy, now recover, yeah. recover. Not, not so bad. So, so the ears are also okay, because if, if there's ear infection, the dog will do this, is it? Oh, oh she did that? When? Uh, that's, that's why she scratched her body, yeah, the armpit area. Yeah, there is There is normally this pain inside the ear or oh, okay. some pain. But so they have the relief. The ear is okay. Yeah, it is, it will relieve the pain. Yeah. It's a reflex of the, uh, the reflex of, so uh, 
what do you what do you put inside the ear? Sometimes you put all those. I replace the cream, yes, the ear drop, and then also the powder that you ask me to buy. I ask you to buy powder. What uh, do I all ask? All your powder, your son, uh, Daniel, what? Daniel, Daniel. Ask you to buy what? I think she dispensed from here. Powder? Powder or oil? Powder. Is it oil? Ear drop. Ear drop is good. Ear drop. Powder, we don't recommend powder for the ear because it blocks the, the whole ear. See, this, this is normally done by who are the groomer, right? Mm. They pluck the hair, right? So. This one is done by the groomer. No, they pluck the ear hair. They put some powder in, right? Mm, I think so. Huh? So they put powder in, they all get stuck inside the horizontal canal. Oh, okay. So, not so the dog feels very uncomfortable, so you keep on trying to scratch it there. Okay. Oh, so the best is uh, not to use powder for the ears. The, the cleaning of the teeth. The teeth, teeth uh, is bad shape. Uh, it, it, it was clean and how come it come back again? Uh? Mm, in fact, it's quite loose. It's the gums, the, the gums are exposed and look. Some dogs have very poor we, teeth. Uh. We did the cleaning scaling yeah. uh, this year, but it came back again. Yeah, some dogs, we eat back food, is it? No, dry food. We eat back food, all right? Dry food, just uh, this uh, dry dog food. No, because his teeth already, uh, the, 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 the gums are exposed already. The scaling was done uh, The gums are exposed already, then you see the gums all. You can see the, the, the roots already. Uh. Then the roots can be seen. Uh. Also, it's a very bad teeth for this dog. Uh, some dogs are born with uh, bad teeth. Uh. Bad structure. Uh, structure. So, okay, so, uh, so the conclusion is, uh, Dissolve the stripe stone, huh? crystal, huh? and during test uh, every uh, Monday for the three months, and then if negative for three months, that means uh, it's just likely to be cleared. Of course, the X-ray uh, at least once. Can I have the scaling done? Scaling done, it, 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 yeah. Teeth. Scaling can be done, but now the reason why he got powder is because his roots are exposed already. Huh? And uh, the the food, he eats wax food, right? No, dry food. Okay, stuck inside. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, thanks.